the incidence of diabetic nephropathy or the diabetic kidney disease in diabetes is about 30 percent in type 1 diabetics and in in type 2 diabetes it is about 40 percent we can remember grossly it is about incidence of diabetic kidney disease is about 40 percent among the diabetic population and regarding diabetic kidney disease when to use the when to use this term before that we will say about the diabetic nephropathy this term has been used historically to describe about the presence of the proteinuria associated with retinopathy in type 1 diabetes patient since albuminuria indicates the glomerular involvement this term classically indicates the glomerular involvement in diabetes that is the glomerular basement membrane thickening mesangial proliferation photocyte injury but later it was found that not only in the glomeruli the tubule interstitium vascular part are also being affected in diabetes so various form of kidney disease other than the diabetic glomerulopathy has also been described so that's why the term diabetic kidney disease have been introduced it is the clinical diagnosis based on the presence of albuminuria and or a low gfr so basically it is defined based on the proteinuria and the decreased gfr this diabetic kidney disease term doesn't specifically describe any pathological entity where the diabetic nephropathy specifically indicates the diabetic glomerulopathy this diabetic kidney disease is the clinical diagnosis of low gfr plus proteinuria obviously diabetic nephropathy might also be a cause of this diabetic kidney disease that can be confirmed only by the diabetic uh, sorry, kidney biopsy